when we heard the call that uh, Jeremy had got into the All White squad, then we had to start book booking our tickets and we managed to get some money to pay off your own. And here we are, we're over here, and they're really enjoying it. It's quite rapid about getting into the squad, and, and the other day when they got to play in the World Cup, well, that's me, you know, it was even better. It was really, we were really proud to see him get a run. Just surprised that the, the local people, just the ordinary local people that are supporting New Zealand, yeah. people in the, working in the shops, they just come up and say, oh, you're from New Zealand. We're very, very happy New Zealand with the result New Zealand had. And, and it's great, you know, it's just, it's just so great to see. Hi, I'm David Warbrick. I'm the um, manager's son. Hi, I'm Matthew Warbrick and I'm his brother and I'm also the manager's son. I like Chris Killen and Leo Bertos. I like Leo Bertos and um, Rory Fallon. Hey, Leo Bertos is popular with kids. What, what's the appeal here, guys? Because he's got skills. The guys really look like they're training hard today and they're very serious. So what are your thoughts about um, the New Zealand team's um, match against Italy this weekend? How do you think we're going to go? I think we might draw. Really? Yeah. It's been a, a roller coaster ride for us from the time that he was selected to getting here and the experiences that we've had and it's been really fantastic. The whole boy and Ken are here, well all the boys are here, there are three boys in our family and Andy's wife's here, Claire, so that's been great that we're all here to support him. Yeah. What were your impressions of the game um, against Slovakia? Wow, it was just so unbelievable as we were coming towards the last three minutes of injury time and I thought, oh, all of a sudden the boys just seemed to think, we've got to do this, we've got to win this and they did, they, the goal went into the, the ball went in the back of the net and it was just the most amazing thing. It was like we'd won, it was just, you know, the first point that we'd scored in the World Cup ever, it was just the most amazing euphoric feeling, it was wonderful. So I guess um, as a, a footballer's mum, after supporting um, Andrew all these years, this must be a real big payoff for you, eh? Well, you know, who would have thought that he was going to be there for the World Cup? I, it's, it's just an unbelievable dream. All our boys are sports fans, and the World Cup is the biggest arena, sports arena that you can come to, and that we're here in South Africa is just unbelievable. Yeah.